Hey guys, Game Boy 3800 here once again, and wow, that is a huge box. If you can't tell already, I'm going to be opening it. This thing is filled with peanuts, and I'm not going to risk it falling. <laughs> and this thing is heavier than I expected. There we go. I think there's nothing else in here. There's not. This thing is huge. You see with peanuts. Well, good thing it didn't fall over. Because we all know how annoying those are. We'll get right back to you as soon as this thing's back on the tripod. Well, after, after all that trouble of getting the box undone, let's finally see what was inside it. And I'm just going to say it did need some protecting. If you can't tell what it is yet, well, then where were you when old Apple got famous? Yeah, this is the Mac Macintosh SE computer. But this is a unique one. You'll see why in a minute. No, not because of all the yellowing on it. God, I hate when that happens. No, there was a puppet that got loose. Now it's back in its home. Hold on one second. As I said before, this um, Macintosh SE here is kind of unique. Why? It has dual floppy drives. There, um, there's not as much as these other as there are with the single floppy drive. But, yeah. Not as much. Simply saying. With the power cord, which I really don't need because I have like god knows how many of these. 9,000! No, I'm not gonna do that. Would you look at that? It has a PC card in it. So here you have a, it's a game port PC card it looks like. So you have Ethernet, it's either Ethernet, no it's not Ethernet, it's um, phone line. Game, phone line, I guess online gaming was new at the time. I don't know what these mean. So either way you have this, which um, is audio out, odd phone line port, printer. Okay, what's going on here? I thought these are. <sighs> Never mind. Never mind. I'm assuming these are 
mouse and keyboard and whatnot. Not sure what that is. It looks kind of like a floppy drive or something. I don't know. If you know what that is, let me know in the comments. Alright, time to fire this thing up. See what's on it. Whoa, serious jump cut. Um, yeah, I couldn't find a power cord that would reach all the way over there. And, hang on, I forgot to do one more thing. Forgot to turn on the power strip. Here we go. Yeah, I have a whole line of power strips behind my TV to power all my, I don't know, 80 plus controls. Well, so that's why I have to say about 20% of them are handheld. Anyways, let's just get back to this. Um, I will say one thing. I don't like the power switch being on the back. I would have just preferred it being up front. So this one you got to reach all the way over to the back. The camera's making it appear a lot brighter than normal, and I'm surprised that the black lines aren't going up and down all over the place. I'm probably going to need a boot disc for this. Ah, no, yeah, welcome to Macintosh. And now, the screen's making everything look odd. But again, I'm really surprised this isn't flickering all over the screen and stuff. This um, Macintosh SE has two 800K drives in it. Dude, look at that. <laughs> yeah, monochrome only. Again, I'm going to need a mouse for this. But as you can see, whoa, now there's lines. It has trash. Should be all the focus right now. Fedora, Fedora Current, and Doma. What? Oh well, I can't tell what it is, so. It's a touchscreen. Oh. Anyways, um, I wish I could just find a way to simply safely shut this down because, well, I don't have a keyboard or mouse or anything. I'm going to check and see if it'll take one of my really old Dell mousers for that file deli. You know what? I don't have one of those with me right now. Oh well. The closest thing I have that has a port that resembles that is an Xbox controller. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna have to, it's gonna say I uh, like a force shut this down and I really don't want to. But as you can see, or I hope you can see, it works quite nicely. Although I would have preferred it to be in color. I wonder how the game for the work. Off you go. Probably just gonna say something like Forgot to try it down safely. Knowing the computers have this time. Oh yeah, and those who saw my video of like fans and stuff, yes, here's a fan. This lap I was gonna say laptop, how stupid of me. This computer weighs abruptly about ten pounds. I'm gonna let you see what it is. Macintosh SE, one megabyte of RAM. I wanna upgrade that sometime to two megabytes. Oh my god, it's near future. Wait, what? And as I said before, two 800K drives. I'm not sure if they mean the floppy diskets or actual drives like inside the thing. I guess we'll never know. Well, I hope you enjoyed this review. Um, thanks, and we out.